2018 Audi Q5 vs 2018 Acura MDX. The 2018 Audi Q5 and 2018 Acura MDX are attractive luxury SUVs that offer buyers a good balance of performance and luxury appointments. They compete against the new Lexus RX and the Infiniti QX60 in a segment gaining in popularity. The Audi Q5 has been completely redesigned for 2018. The red design addresses many of the shortcomings of the previous generation while adding the latest in Audi's infotainment and safety technologies. The 2018 Acura MDX is mostly a carryover from the 2017 model year. For 2018, the company updated the SUV's infotainment system. This slideshow will help you determine whether the 2018 Audi Q5 or 2018 Acura MDX is the better SUV overall based on US news scoring in individual categories. You may notice slight score variations in these categories versus US news reviews. Each category's score is constantly updated as new expert reviews and data become available. Read on to find out which of these luxury SUVs is best, and if it's worth upgrading from the 2-row Q5 to the 3-row MDX. The 2018 Audi Q5 is smaller than the Acura MDX so it makes sense that it has a lower starting price. The base Q5 starts at $41,500, which is high for its class but low compared to the MDX. Its top trim is priced at $54,300. The Audi Q5 comes standard with all-wheel drive, something that costs extra on the Acura model. The 2018 Acura MDX with front-wheel drive starts at $44,200. However, for that price increase, you get an extra row of seating. Both vehicles come with a long list of standard features that easily bring up the price tag in other luxury SUVs. A fully loaded MDX costs $58,650. Neither the 2018 Audi Q5 nor the 2018 Acura MDX has been rated for reliability by JD Power. The 2017 MDX, which is mechanically similar to the 2018 model, got a 2.5 out of 5, slightly below average. The 2017 Q5 got a 3 out of 5, which is average, but we can't count that because the 2018 Q5 is all new. The Q5 and MDX come backed by a 4 year slash 50 comma 000 mile basic warranty. The MDX is offered with an additional 6 year slash 70 comma 000 mile power rain warranty. The 2018 Audi Q5 has one of the best interiors in its class. Its seats are supportive and comfortable. 8-way power adjustable front seats come standard, with heated front seats, a heated steering wheel, ventilated front seats, 4-way lumbar support, Alcantara upholstery, 12-way power adjustable front sport seats, and driver's seat memory settings as available features. The cabin of the 2018 Acura MDX contains comfortable seating for adults in its first two rows, with similarly plush standard leather seats. However, like many three-row SUVs, its back seats are best for small children or the family dog. Additional standard features include a 10-way power adjustable driver's seat, an 8-way power adjustable front passenger seat, heated front seats, a power tilting and telescoping steering wheel, and a sliding and reclining second row. Available upgrades include Milano leather upholstery, ventilated front seats, heated second row seats, and a heated steering wheel. The 2018 Acura MDX has more cargo space than the 2018 Audi Q5 when all its rear seats are stowed, which makes sense because it's the bigger vehicle. The MDX has 14.9 cubic feet of cargo space behind the third row, which is about average for its class. It has 38.4 cubic feet of cargo space with the third row folded and 68.4 cubic feet with the second and third rows folded. Behind the rear seats of the Q5 there is 26.8 cubic feet of cargo space. With those seats folded, the number increases to 60.4 cubic feet. Both models come standard with a power liftgate. A hands-free power liftgate is available on the Q5. 
The interiors of the 2018 Audi Q5 and 2018 Acura MDX have excellent fit and finish. The Q5's cabin is outfitted with high-quality materials. It is stylish and features modern design that sets it apart from other SUVs. The MDX's interior is fitted with premium materials, though it isn't quite as upscale as many of the other luxury SUVs in its class. The 2018 Audi Q5 and 2018 Acura MDX come loaded with a long list of standard features. However the Audi edges out the Acura in this category because of its available advanced convenience, safety, and connectivity technology. Also, the Q5's infotainment system is easier to use than the MDX's. The Q5's standard features include Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, a rear-view camera, a 7-inch infotainment display, a 5-inch driver information display, voice command, a 10-speaker sound system, HD radio, two USB ports, Bluetooth, and push-button ignition. The Acura MDX comes equipped with Tri-Zone Automatic Climate Control, four USB ports, Bluetooth, an 8-speaker audio system, satellite radio, a moonroof, a proximity key, Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, Siri Eyes Free, and a dual-screen infotainment system with an upper 8-inch display and a lower 7-inch touchscreen standard. Available features in the Q5 include a 7-inch driver information display, a panoramic sunroof, rear cross-traffic alert, satellite radio, navigation, front and rear park assist, blind spot monitoring, the Audi Connect Care telematics system, the MMI all-in touch touchpad with handwriting recognition, a 19-speaker sound system, a 12.3-inch virtual cockpit, an 8.3-inch infotainment display, a head-up display, a 360-degree camera system, Audi Connect Plus with a Wi-Fi hotspot, and Audi Connect Prime, which includes Google Alert, voice recognition, my Audi destinations, predictive traffic and weather, internet radio, and applications like Twitter. Available features in the MDX include remote start, GPS-linked climate control, navigation, a 10 or 12-speaker ELS audio system, HD radio, voice recognition, two USB ports in the third row, the Acura-linked telematics system, and a 9-inch or 16.2-inch rear seat entertainment system with two wireless headphones. The base Audi Q5 has a 252-horsepower turbocharged 2.0-liter four-cylinder engine mated to a 7-speed automatic transmission, which delivers smooth shifts. An upgraded 354-horsepower twin-turbocharged 3.0-liter V6 is available in the SQ5 trim and comes paired with a smooth-shifting 8-speed automatic transmission. The MDX comes with a 290-horsepower 3.5-liter V6 that is mated to a 9-speed automatic transmission. It lacks the refinement that Audi's transmissions exhibit, and at times can appear to be searching for the right gear. The 2018 Acura MDX gets 20 miles per gallon in the city and 27 miles per gallon on the highway, while the Q5 gets 23 miles per gallon in the city and 27 miles per gallon on the highway. The Q5's powerful V6 option gets only 19 miles per gallon on the highway and 24 in the city. The 2018 Audi Q5 and Acura MDX ride smoothly over the road's imperfections and round corners with ease, delivering very little body roll. Each model offers a number of drive modes to deliver varying degrees of performance depending on the driver's choice. However, only one model comes with standard all-wheel drive, the Q5. The Insurance Institute for Highway Safety IIHS, has given the 2018 Audi Q5 and 2018 Acura MDX the same good ratings in all its crash tests. The vehicles have not yet been fully evaluated by the National Highway Traffic Safety Administration NSA. The Q5 comes with a number of standard safety technologies, including Audi PreSense Basic, which senses when a crash is imminent and closes the windows and available panoramic sunroof, tightens the seatbelts, and prepares the braking system. Audi PreSense City is standard and includes forward collision warning, pedestrian warning, and pre-collision braking up to 52 miles per hour rear cross-traffic alert, satellite radio, navigation, 
front and rear park assist, blind spot monitoring, and vehicle exit assist, which alerts a driver when vehicles or cyclists are approaching and may be impacted by door openings, are all available. Acura's MDX has numerous standard safety technologies, including a rear view camera and the Acura Watch suite of driver assistance features, which includes active lane keep assist, road departure mitigation, forward collision warning, automatic emergency braking, and adaptive cruise control. Advanced adaptive cruise control, front and rear parking sensors, a surround view camera system, blind spot monitoring, and rear cross-traffic alert technologies are available. Because the MDX offers more safety features standard, it takes the win. The Audi Q5's fresher interior design, powerful engine choices, numerous advanced connectivity technologies, and high-quality cabin make it the winner in this head-to-head -head contest. However, it is pricey for a two-row compact luxury SUV. The Acura MDX is still a solid choice for budget-conscious luxury three-row SUV buyers. If you're looking to upgrade your Q5 to a three-row SUV and want to know what else to consider besides the MDX, the new 2018 Lexus RXL offers all the comforts and convenience of the Lexus RX with an added row of seating and superior fuel economy compared to the Q5 and MDX. The Volvo XC90 offers a sharp interior, excellent passenger space, great fuel economy, and tons of high-tech features for a reasonable price. There's also the excellent Audi Q7, although it costs more than both the Q5 and MDX. To learn more about these vehicles, check out the Audi Q5's review and the Acura MDX's review. Then, see how they stack up to the competition by exploring our new vehicle rankings. When it comes time to buy, use our best price program to find the dealership in your area offering the lowest prices. Shoppers who use the program save an average of $3,279 off their new car purchase. <laughs>